mechanism of respiration, breathing, inspiration and expiration. The process of breathing or ventilation involves inspiration and expiration, which together constitute pulmonary respiration and a short pause. Respiration is an automatic and involuntary process by which the expansion and contraction of lungs follow one after the other for inspiration and expiration to take place. Mechanism of Inspiration Contraction of external intercoastal muscles, that is, the muscles present between the ribs, increases the volume of the thorax laterally and dorsally. Contraction of the diaphragm increases the size of the thoracic cavity from the anterior to the posterior side. As a result of these contractions, there is an increase in the volume of the thoracic cavity and consequently, the lungs expand. Air from outside rushes in to fill the lungs and inspiration is thus accomplished. Mechanism of Expiration Relaxation of the external intercostal muscles and the diaphragm decreases the volume of the thoracic cavity which returns to its normal size. As a result, the lungs also come back to their normal size and the air from the lungs is squeezed out resulting in expiration. This is followed by a short pause. Decrease in thoracic volume is accelerated by the contraction of abdominal muscles and also the internal intercostal muscles, which helps in vigorous expiration. External respiration In the lungs, the trachea branches into even smaller tubes called bronchioles, which end in alveolar sacs. Each sac is covered by capillaries. Gas exchange is carried out by the small alveolar sacs that take up most of the space in the lungs. Inhaled oxygen enters the air sacs and then passes through the thin walls of alveoli to the red blood cells in the surrounding capillaries. As the red blood cells lose their carbon dioxide and gain oxygen, their color changes from bluish to red. The carbon dioxide transferred from the capillaries to the air sacs is expelled from the lungs.